Hey guys, I just wanted to make a really, really short video now, um, uh, and I wanted to show you how to remove all ads from um, almost any website except for YouTube, uh, but it works with all other websites, apparently. And for this, you will need the program Firefox and the knowledge of Firefox add-ons. So, first, uh, well, I created a short little link here. Uh, link short, you just go to bit.ly slash adblocker. And this brings you to an add-on page for Firefox. Just click on Add to Firefox. Accept the installation. It will almost instantly install. Being a Mac, you don't have to wait that long for it to restart. Okay, and it's already installed. Uh, you can just check this by going to Add ons. And here at the top is Ad Blocker. Now, before we test this out, let's just go to Preferences and set some exceptions to this rule. Now, um, uh, since I'm providing you with this information, I like you for, to enter in the text flurple.com and uply.us. Just a small little favor on your part towards me. And make sure to visit those websites too. Flurple.com is a flash game website, and uply.us is a unlimited file hosting website. Instead of like rapid share or whatever. Okay, so just quit that up. Now we just test it out, like, you know, say you go to eBay, make a search, and then you'll be able to see clearly on the side that where there's supposed to be an advertisement, there is no advertisement. Nice, right? Okay. And uh, let's see where else we can try this out. Well, you can go to Epic Ninja, and there's normally supposed to be a huge ad right here, there's not. Uh, now there's it right here, it just disappears like that. So yeah, that's basically all there is to it. Um, so this blocks ads from you know Google AdSense and uh, DoubleClick and other advertising networks like that. And so it's uh, real handy if you don't want to pay for you know extra features like you know on a Mac ad blocking from the site itself you know you can automatically block all their ads which is a really useful tool and you should also consider using Firefox and Mac because they're both superior and that is all for now thank you bye.